Looks like one team is um, taking a little bit of time to respond still. But the war game request. Looks like one team took it and one team didn't, which is mm. weird. Let's try a pressing it again. Oh, 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 what is that? Oh, oh, in the first game, the first map of the best of three series is going to be on Ruins Order on. So, Ruins of Lordaeron. It's a smaller map, right? And uh, I don't see three players on Team Ariana Grande. Oh, there they are. We Oh, dude, it's freaking Krill. We got Krill, Shifty ZX, and Ty Milla going up against Driftings, Unafraid, and Easy Game. So, Rogue Mage Druid going up against a God Comp on a map as small as Ruins. Do you have any insight? I feel like Rogues don't really have problems connecting, though, with, with their versus speed, but is yeah, there an definitely. advantage? With, with versus speed, I don't know, man. If he goes, uh, you know, his second interrupt, it's going to be crazy, man, for, for the, the God comp. But we're going to see. I know RMD is a really, really uh, good counter up against God comp. But we're going to see. I mean, Krill is one of the top Shadow Priests in the game. So we're, we're going to see how this plays out. Oh, always has been, hasn't he? Pamela trying to get the, the, the other team out of stealth. And it looks like they're going to be going on to Krill. Tamila now in a sap. And no damage is going out quite yet. Krill now in a Garot. And uh, looks like a lot of damage is going out on the Krill uh, for their opener. And this is Orb. This is Orb for Driftings as he's put into a half Polymorph. Unafraid now putting Krill into a Kidney Shot. Full blind goes on the Shifty. And Krill may be... Oh, there is a Trinket in the Iron Bark. Nature Swiftness on the Krill. Krill's going to be fine for now. Unafraid now horrified as Easy Game is in a full ring. Unafraid in a Bash now. Is this going to give you any defensive cooldowns for Unafraid? He's at 50% health here. And Easy Game is forced to Trinket. Yeah, the silence goes on the drifting. The NS is going to come out of easy game. Unafraid still taking a lot of damage. It's not going to be enough. The quality is going to come out of Unafraid, but the cloak is actually going to come out onto Unafraid as well. So it looks like he's going to be able to save some time for, for easy game to come out of that CC and be able to top uh, Unafraid back up. But that was really, really good burst coming out of uh, Ariana Grande here. Uh, the killing spree is going to come out from Unafraid. Silence also going to go on the drifting into a polymorph. Double fear is going to come out from Krill there. Really, really good fear into a disarm onto Unafraid there. It looks like Unafraid is going to be their target. It looks like they're going to be blowing their cooldowns into Unafraid. Afraid, but Unafraid is going to be spamming that uh, evasion there. Easy game being able to get some heals. The Heart of the Wild is going to come out from Easy game. Cyclone is going to come out onto Unafraid. They're just stopping some of the heals coming out. Krill taking a little bit of damage, but not too much. And, and uh, I think uh, here to beat Nesper is going to have to try to do some really, really good proxy to to be able to get a kill. Yeah, Cloak's still not up yet, man. So Unafraid is potentially in trouble. Easy game coming out of that CC as Unafraid's jumping right back into the fight. Looking for Krill. Krill is going to be the kill target for this uh, Rogue Mage. Druid team, it looks like, uh, but they haven't gotten dispersed out of him yet. There's the kidney shot uh, uh, out on the Krill, but he's still hovering quite well as Shifty's not eating any CC quite yet. Now, uh, Krill is still trying to, to, to connect and unafraid whenever he's uh, not taking damage, he's trying to line of sight. There is the fear going out on to unafraid. Oh, Cloak goes out on unafraid right before that damage comes in. An easy game's in a, in a poly, but both teams look like they're completely fine right now, just trying to get their bearings and trying to, to set up. Now, Krill is in a kidney shot here. He's at 50% health here. This is killing spree. He's taking so much damage. Shifty X is in a, a full polymorph, and that is going to be the disperance being forced out of Krill. Yeah, so really good CC on the Shifty, just kind of scaring Krill, making him have to bring out the, the Disperse there. And that's going to come out from Shifty's on, onto Krill there, and it's going to top him back up, but he's still going to be taking quite a bit of damage here, unafraid, just kind of running around, just spamming uh, a lot of the damage onto Krill. And he's actually at full energy, which is kind of the funny thing. But Easy Game is going to be put into that deep. Tamilia is going to be put in that deep as well to stop that Polymorph from coming out onto Easy Game. But Tamilia is still going to try to get that Polymorph out. The Trinket is going to come out from him, and he's going to be able to land a Poly onto Unafraid, which is a really good Poly. Hopefully, they'll be able to get it onto Easy Game or something and be able to set up a kill here. The uh, Klesiphone is going to come out onto Unafraid there, just trying to stop some of the damage so they can be able to uh, position themselves in, in a good place for them to, to get some CC and be able to secure a kill here. Uh, Tamilia is still spamming out those Polymorphs. Uh, but easy game is going to be quick to dispel this unafraid taking a little bit of damage here uh, But not too much and Krill just trying to get his uh, BTs up That is going to try to get some of those flies out But it is going to be interrupted the ring of frost is going to come out onto easy game But it is going to be immediately trinketed there unafraid getting put into that disarm But he is also going to get a, a kidney out into another into a bash onto unafraid It looks like unafraid is still going to be the target. I think they're trying to get unafraid uh, You know trying to get a stun on him outside uh, of the um, 
uh, excuse me, out of his, uh, uh, not pain death, what is it called? Gosh dang it, I'm sorry. Go ahead, you go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Full blind goes out on the Shifty. Oh, and there's the kidney shot in the Krill. This is Orb coming out for team here to beat Nesper. Shifty's in CC, and Krill's taking quite a bit of damage, but he's gonna get Nature Swiftness up to full. Drifting's now taking a lot of damage. He's at 48% health here, and the cross CC goes out in the easy game and unafraid at the same time, and Drifting's is forced to block. Is it gonna get massive spell up here? Doesn't look like it quite yet, and they're gonna go ahead and shift their damage over onto unafraid. Easy game still in a CC, and Drifting not getting any healing in that full block. And he's at 28% health here, and he's in a bomb. This could be it right now. And he does get Nature Swiftness and Iron Bark. He's going to be okay here as that triple bomb comes out. Krill taking still a little bit of damage. And the, oh, th this is going to be killing spree. And Krill is in some trouble. He's at 38% health here. There goes Iron Bark on the Krill, but is it going to be enough? Uh, he's trying to get him out of CC, and the sap goes out in the shifty, and another deterrent dispersion is uh, forced out of Krill. Krill is in some trouble. He's coming out of dispersion at 36% health here. Uh, Polymorph goes out in the easy game, and Drift King's now taking a lot of damage as he's in. A silence uh krill in a now in a half kidney shot but it looks like he's gonna be okay for now shifty x is trying to stabilize but this positioning is really forcing driftings to be really up in their face and vulnerable he's at 45 percent health here in e uh, easy game now in a bash uh is this gonna be another block already looks like he's gonna be there's the full polymorph on the drifting driftings now as the block a second time this is both blocks already and it's all due to this positioning they're pulling them back they're making them vulnerable and they're looking for their hard switches in there they're making them pay for being pushed in like this easy game now in a full fear and drifting is out of the block he's at 46 percent health here and he could just go down any minute yeah the full kitten does come out on the grill unafraid just trying to peel for his teammates the deep is going to go out to easy game is he going to be able to get a play to follow that up and the cyclone is actually going to get put onto timely that he's not going to be able to get the polymorph and he is going to be able to land the polymorph now onto unafraid but it is going to be trinketed by unafraid it was a dr poly but the uh killing spree is going to come out onto krill here he's dipping pretty low i'm not exactly sure if it's going to be enough i think sh uh shifties is going to be able to top him back up but the polymorph is going to come out on the shifties here and it looks like krill is going to be able to be top back up full kitty onto shifties there drip king is getting pretty low but he the ns is going to come out from easy game it's top him back up Full, uh, Shifties is going to come out of that kidney and it doesn't look like anybody's taking enough damage for Shifties to have to do anything crazy like to, to, to get out of Trinket or something like that. But we are starting to get a little bit deeper into dampening and I, man, we're just going to have to see how this plays out. Yeah, unafraid. Still pushing in on these guys, and I like how they're pulling back into the room. They're forcing these guys to be uh, unafraid now. Horrified at 40% health here. This is the orb. This could be it right now. Cloak is forced out of unafraid, and uh, Iron Bark coming out from Easy Game and Trinket. And uh, now his cloak is down, and Easy Game's in a full CC. Unafraid's in trouble. He's at 27% health here, and Shifty ZX in a full poly. But his team is completely offensive. 14% on unafraid, and Easy Game is in a triple DR polymorph as unafraid is just sitting at 20% health here. But this is the vanish. He comes back out. Easy game gets silenced and unafraid. Looks like he's still taking quite a bit of damage. He's at 29% here. Uh, they switch back over to him. Alpha Drifting getting uh, f severely low. He's at 33% here. Drifting could just go down. He's out of blocks. He's in trouble. And he's also Moom. And he's just trying to spell spiel as best he can. Ring of Frost goes down. A defensive ring gets Timelia, but it was very DR. Krill now taking a little bit of damage from Unafraid, but I feel like here to beat Nesper is completely defensive as Easy Game is now in a full polymorph and Unafraid is in a full ring. It's like a 3v1 coming out of this god count man yeah shifties is going to be put into that full blind but uh he is just going to uh, have to be forced to sit it since he used his trinket a little while ago unafraid going to be put into that full poly easy game going to be cl cloned up just keep taking a bit of damage here trying to spam polys onto timelia there he's going to be able to get him but i don't think it's going to be enough the drift King is still sitting pretty low trying to still get some polymorphs out but he's not going to be able to unafraid going to be bombing on the krill krill's getting really low the dispersion is going to have to come out he went to 20 percent there but shifty's going to have to do something to top him back up polys are still being bammed onto shifties but it looks like the ns is going to come out and krill is it just doesn't look like it's gonna be enough heal he still has krill, it on him oh, oh krill, yeah there, yeah yeah there there you go it is used now and krill is gonna be top back up shifty's just uh putting out some cyclones onto unafraid there uh polymorphs into easy game and into a full fear this could be it for drifting's here cold snap is gonna come out and the block is gonna come out easy game sitting that fear right there and he did not he still has trinket though he could have used it and saved drifting's but they decided to keep the 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 trinket and drifting's is just gonna sit that block he's still pretty low here easy game's not gonna be able to top back up inside of that but the ns is gonna come out onto drifting's and it looks like they're gonna stabilize yeah stabilizing again but mind you we're at 20 percent dampening at this point and the pressure coming out from this god comp definitely is dominant so far um unafraid now at 63 percent health here and drift kings now taking a lot of damage this is orb on the drift kings devouring plague six percent deep freeze goes on the easy game and he's just gonna flop he just ran out of defensive cooldowns and the constant setup coming out of krill and timilla just forced this rogue mage druid team to run out of uh buttons to press you know wow what a game dude
22% yeah. dampening against two teams that are all about setup. So that is going to be the first match between these two teams. And this is the best of three. If, uh, if they take it again, we'll see what happens. I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Uh, let me go ahead and talk to the losing team and see what map they're interested in having next. Yeah, definitely, definitely a good matchup. I mean, RMD, to be honest, a lot of people that play at a high rated level, they think that RMD should definitely be able to beat God Comp. And, and I think so as well. And I mean, you can you can see the the skill coming out from from Ariana Grande here. I mean, there, there are definitely skilled players and to see them come back from or to see them not really come back because they didn't lose yet. But to see them really just just dominate the arena up against an RMD just goes to show uh, you know, like it, it's exciting to see somebody with, with such skill be able to play in these tournaments and uh, you know, it, it's really good. I, I enjoy watching good games like that one. Yeah, so the next map that is requested by Here to Beat Nesper is going to be on the Grand Arena. I'm going to try to jump right into that. Uh, and here we go, boys. <laughs> So, this is going to be in the Grand Arena. Ariana Grande is Tyne Milla, Krill, and Shifty ZX going up against uh, the second place uh, team from our last tournament, Unafraid, Easy Game, and Drift Game. So, uh, definitely a convincing first match coming out of this God Comp in that first game there. But, um, can they? This is their map, though. Can they set up a kill on their map? We're going to have to find out, man. Yeah, absolutely. I. Man, get it, training Krill like that, like, I feel like every single time, uh, I mean, Killing Spree comes back fairly quickly, right? As soon as, long as you have the uptime, and I just felt like every single time, they knew exactly what they needed to do, every time. Easy game, getting trapped, getting stunned out of stealth right away. Solid move by Tamilla. Wow, getting him out of stealth very quickly is definitely an advantage, and uh, they're just trying to get these guys out of stealth, and they nearly got the rogue out of stealth. He was so close. He's going in. Who's he going to sap? It looks like... I'm not sure. Krill is in combat at this point. Oh, Sap goes out on the Timilla and Deep Freeze on the Shifty X. They're looking for that 3v1 opener. Garot on to Krill. Krill now taking quite a bit of damage. Actually, there's the kidney shot. There's the damage coming out. This is Cloak already. They want to get offensive. They want to get some defensive cooldown. Shifty now in that uh, polymorph into a full clone. Krill trying to fear, trying to get them defensive. Full polymorph going out into Drifting an easy game in a Deep Freeze. But that was Adrenaline Rush, and Krill uh, is at 50% health here still. Ironbird coming out on the Krill. It looks like he's going to be okay, man. Yeah, it definitely Krill's going to be okay. Especially, I mean, Shifty's such a good healer. He's able to, to top him back up. Uh, full Cyclone goes on to Timelia from Easy Game. Just kind of trying to stop some of the setup that, that Godcom has to offer here. Uh, Krill is taking a little bit of damage. The Deep is going to go on to Shifty's. Is he going to be able to get a Poly to follow that up? I don't think so, because he is going to get silenced out of that. The ring might come out here. The, uh, the Polymorph did get interrupted there. Unafraid sitting really low. The Bash is going to come out. 9%. He's spamming Faint, trying to live. The Trinket and NS is going to come out from Easy Game. They're going to be able to top him back up, but those are two huge cooldowns down coming from easy game there. Ariana Grande did uh, a really good job in getting those CCs. Krill's sitting pretty low here, 30%. Uh, is he going to be able to, to be topped back up by Shifty? And he's still sitting really low, but the NS is going to come out as well. And so Krill is going to be topped back up here. The full clone is going to come out, on, or the full uh, poly is going to come out to easy game. Science coming out on the Drift Kings. It looks like Drift Kings is going to be the, the target again. Uh, easy game is going to be put into a polymorph again. Are they going to have anything out of those polymorphs? Deep is going to come out. Is he going to be able to get a Cyclone? I don't think. He, they're going to have a CC to follow it up, but the Polymorph is going to come out onto Unafraid there. Spamming Faint, trying to take as least damage as possible. Polymorph again, Silence coming out into Drip Kings there, deep onto Shifties, but I don't think they're going to be able to get a Poly as Krill um, is going to get that Disarm onto Drip Kings there. Uh, Drip Kings still spamming out Polys, but it looks like he's going to be the target still, trying to get the setup that they need. Tamili's going to be put into that Poly, just trying to peel some of the damage off, and hopefully Ariana Grande is going to be able to get a nice setup here. Yeah, I don't know. It looks like uh, both teams are kind of peeling back and making sure that uh, they're, they're looking for the setup here. Uh, Full Poly goes out on the easy game. And a fear on the unafraid. DR Poly on the easy game. Drift King silence. The triple CC going out for this team. Out of a deep freeze on the easy game. And Drift King is, is, is taking a lot of damage. And another block is forced. This easy game is in a... Um 
is in. Oh, I'm sorry. There's the, oh, wow. There is the smoke bomb coming out on the Krill. Deep freeze on the Shifty. Shifty's sitting in a, in a different form, avoiding those polys, though. Krill taking quite a bit of damage, but he has Iron Bar Drift King now, pushing in, trying to get some damage out while he's low himself. I love the cross CC going out on Unafraid, really preventing that damage on the Krill. But Drift King's now is pushing in, and he's at 50% health here. This God Comp's pulling back and waiting for their setup. They're waiting for that one big shot. Uh, there's the deep freeze on the easy game, but Drift King's is... Is definitely the kill target still, and he's trying to line of sight as best he can. And there's the kidney shot on the Krill. They're looking for some damage, and the Ring of Frost is going to get silenced. Nice job by Tamilla. Shifty now in a, in a bash into a full cyclone, but uh, Krill not taking enough damage quite yet. That was the double Frost Nova coming out from the mage, and Krill's going to be okay. Uh, easy game now. In a, oh, he trinkets that man. He actually trinketed that ring. Yeah, and the triple fear actually came out of Krill. Really good fear, but it looks like they're going to get the setup here that they want. The Cyclone is going to go on to Tamili and to a poly on to Shifties, but they're not going to do enough damage going on to Krill here. He's going to be put into that full kidney, but not very much damage. Easy game going to be put into that silence. They're trying to get the, the Cyclones off, but not going to be able to get them off. Drift Kings is trying to spam some Frost Bolts, getting as much damage as possible there. Krill taking a little bit of damage. Still going to be the target here for uh, here to beat Nesper, but uh, Easy Game is going to be, uh, you know, getting a, an Iron Bark out, out onto Drift Kings there. Drift Kings taking a little bit of damage. It looks like Easy Game is just really doing a good job on his mana. Shifty is, is at 80%. It looks like both of them are just doing a really good job in managing their mana here. Dude, Shifty ZX is doing an amazing job keeping Krill completely, uh, completely hotted up all the time. Look at Drift King's mana. He's trying to purge these heals off of Krill, but he just can't keep up with Shifty. Krill now taking a stun as Shifty is in bear form in that deep freeze, so he can't get polyed out. This is killing Spree right here, and it, it didn't do too, too much. Krill's at 50% health here, but Shifty's in a full polymorph. This could be dispersed right here. He's holding onto it as much as he can, unafraid now, taking a lot of damage. He's going to get Nature Swiftness up, but Easy Game was in a polymorph there. Uh, Krill still holding on to his disperse for dear life and shifty zx does get that that uh nature swiftness out but now krill is in a kidney shot and swifty's shifty's in a full uh cyclone and that's going to merit that disperse pop uh so these these two players are definitely on the same page really trying to prevent the defensive cooldowns from coming out iron barks on krill at this point and uh easy game now in a deep freeze uh, into a full polymorph look like unafraid may potentially be the kill target right here the orb is coming out uh and uh, Polymorphs go out onto Timely, really preventing all that damage for Drift Kings. Now is in some trouble. He's at 60% health here. He's trying to peel. There's the kidney shot onto Krill at this point. And uh, Krill is taking a little bit of damage, but nothing significant enough to really force any more defensive cooldowns out of Shifty. But Drift King, on the other hand, is at 40% health here. Killing Spree coming out on top of Krill here. He doesn't have a Disperse, mind you. Uh, Shifty ZX is in bear form, trying to prevent the polys from coming out. And it looks like Krill's going to be okay, even through that Killing Spree. Yeah, and so man, they're just keeping a lot of a lot of pressure onto Krill. Shifty's going to be put into that that deep, but and they're not going to be able to land that ring, seeing as the disarm is going to come up from Krill onto Drifting. There, the full the full poly is going to go onto Unafraid, but it is actually going to overlap with the Cyclone, which is uh, pretty questionable. It's going to be a little bit less of CC that they're going to have in order to put onto Unafraid to peel some of that damage. But uh, it looked like that was already a lot of his damage, so it's not going to be too scary. Drifting taking a little bit of damage. He still already has block again, and Cyclone's going to be put onto Timelia there. The NS is going to come out from Easy Game there. Which which is going to be pretty good and it's going to top drifting back up but he's still going to be taking quite a bit of damage here the deep is going to come out onto shifties is he going to be able to poly it off I mean, he's not going to be able to do that the silence is going to come out onto drifting easy game put be going to be put into that deep as well but uh time is not going to be able to put in to get put the uh, easy game into that poly either but the cold snap is going to come out from drift kings and, and he's starting to run a little bit um at 11 percent mana there if he's going to be put into a full poly krill is uh starting to take a, a bit of damage here it could be maybe a scary setup coming from uh, here to be nesper but we're just gonna have to see yeah, Drift Kings now, that was, he blocked and then uh, canceled it fairly quickly because he's full health from the cold snap, but I mean, they're running out of defensive cooldowns. I mean, Krill and his Shifty ZX are doing a great job holding on to their stuff in Timilla. Whenever it comes down to it, he's doing a great job making sure to cr cross CC. Look at Unafraid sitting this full poly. Look at Easy Game in this deep freeze and potentially into a ring, into a full poly more. Drift King's in some trouble. Second block is already forced. Timilla just controlling the game. Krill holding on to his defensive cooldowns and Shifty really preventing as many polys as humanly possible. Oh man, 30% dampening and Drift King's is at 46% health here. 
He's trying to line of sight as much damage as possible as his healer displaces back in the line of sight. Can he shot into Krill and Polly onto Timella? Uh, now the pressure is swapped back onto Krill. Is this going to be a disperse? Shifty now in a deep freeze in human. He could get pollied out, but he's in the orb, so it's going to break. Uh, Krill at 59% health gear. Drift King now horrified, uh, but Iron Bark is, is still up on him. Easy game in a deep freeze. Uh, Garrote goes on to Shifty, but so far Krill looks like he's going to be okay as Iron Bark's still active. Now Drift King doesn't have an Iron Bark anymore, and Devouring Plague is out. He's trying to ring a frost defensively. Doesn't get it off, and he goes into a fear. And both teams are uh, going to go ahead and stabilize this easy game. Nature Swift and Drift King's back up. Yeah, and so easy game trying to stand some Cyclone, getting a Cyclone onto Shifty's X there. Drifting taking a little bit of damage. Looks like Krill's going to be the target again. Smoke Bomb is going to come out from Unafraid there, but he is going to get polyed up. And so uh, Krill taking, still taking a bit of damage. Polymorph is going to come out onto Unafraid there. He's going to have to sit that one. It's going to be a DR though, but the, the deep poly is going to come out onto Shifty's X there. And uh, Krill starting to take a little bit of damage. Are they going to be able to follow up CC onto Shifty? Hey, it's going to be it. Uh, the Disperse is going to come out from Krill there. Shifty X is going to be able to get an, an NS, I think, uh, on onto uh, Krill. Krill there and the full blind actually is going to come out to Shifty. He does have Trinket, but I think he's going to save it. I don't, I think they they know that uh, here to beat Nesper doesn't have enough damage, so Shifty's actually is going to have to worry about that. But he's going to be put in that full bash, and the uh, the Trinket is going to have to come out, I'm getting a little scared there. The Iron Bark is going to come out onto Krill as well, so it looks like they're going to be able to save that time. But a full poly gets put on the Shifty. This is, could be really good. It's going to be really scared for Krill. Krill's getting pretty low 25%. The road is going to have to come out. I don't think he can use anything. He has nothing. Shifty's going to be put in that DR poly. Krill could go down. He's a live lord right now. 9%. Shifty's going to be put in that full cyclone. I think this is going to be it right here. Trying to spam the flash of lights, but it is not going to be enough. And it looks like we're going to have a series here. One win for uh, here to beat Nesper and one win for Ariana Grande. We're going to see who is going to move on to the next bracket. Well then. Holy crap. So that was 26% damping and the first game was around 22% dampening. So both teams definitely looking for those setups and uh, ultimately they came out ahead there. Um, I think that the dampening game definitely is in favor of, of the rogue mage druid team. I think that rogues bring a bit more consistent pressure than uh, say a shadow priest. So yeah, definitely. I would agree. So I'm going to go ahead and ask, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and ask, um, uh, Ty Milla on Ariana Grande, what our next map's gonna be. One to one, here to beat Nesper going up against Ariana Grande. Some of the best players on Ariana, Ariana Grande's team is just uh, definitely here to play, that's for sure. Ty Milla. Yeah. Looks like the next map is going to be on the grand <laughs> uh just uh just to let you guys know what's going on if the technical difficulties do happen inside the game these players have to um consistent keep playing 45 seconds into the game they can't just leave so uh just so you guys know um apparently shifty's mic was actually dead the whole time oh wow unfortunate so uh there's that so next map is going to be on the Grand Arena. Actually, Tolveron. Tolveron is going to be the next map. That's interesting. They want Tolveron Arena. I wonder. I wonder what's going to happen on Tolveron Arena. Trying to get both these teams to accept the war game on Tolveron Arena and we'll jump right into it and this will be the last game out of the best of three series Ariana Grande going up against here to beat Nesper and this is Tolveron Arena Sorry about that, guys. I interrupted your thingamajig, but we're jumping into Tolveron Arena now. This is Timilla, Krill, and Shifty ZX going up against Drift King's Unafraid and Easy Game. Uh, the names are switched up. Uh, uh, no, they aren't. They aren't. Here to Beat Nesper is correct, and Ariana Grande is correct. So, this is the best of three. So, whoever wins this match will advance. I don't know, man. I think uh, they're not going to be able to beat Nesper if they lose right here. <laughs> I'm not sure. I mean, it, it looked like uh, it looked like here to be Nesper kind of figured out what to do. So I, 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 mean, I think I think it, it should be good. RMD uh, once again just is it, it should definitely be God Complex. 
you know, we have some really good players coming from Ariana Grande. So I don't know. We'll see how, how it uh, pans out. Let's see what happens, man. They're trying to get him out uh, with that Mines here looking for him, but they're on the opposite side. Um, let's see where the sap goes here. As Shifty ZX is in human form, he goes bare. Krill gets sapped. And who's the damage going to actually be on it? Looks like it's probably going to be on... Nope, it's going to be on Krill. The swap goes over onto Time Millie as he gets sapped. Shifty X in the deep freeze. Probably going to try to get ringed out of it. He can't get polyed. And he shadow melds and gets out of there. Krill's going to be okay here. But the double fear goes out in the Driftings and Unafraid. Unafraid now. Looks like he's going to be the kill target for now. Yeah, exactly. And so he is going to get a deep onto easy game there. It looks like he might be able to get a ring, but for some reason it just didn't go out. Oh, he trinketed that. Excuse me. Wow. Uh, I was wondering. It didn't even look like he went into it. It's so weird. But uh, the Polymorph is going to go on to Timelia there. Unafraid is going to get the full kidney onto Krill. It looks like Krill is going to be the target once again here. Yeah, I think it's definitely a good target. The target, the Bash is going to go out into Shifties there. Krill is dipping pretty low already. They're getting a lot of really good early game pressure in this game. But the last two games, it wasn't as good. Drifting taking a lot of damage as well, though. Uh, Krill is going to try to get the VT out, but he is going to be locked out on that easy game. Going to be put into that Polymorph. Drifting is still sitting in that, that, that block, but it looks like he is going to break that block. And it looks like they're going to get a lot of damage onto Krill here. The Killing Spree is going to come out uh, into a, a kidney. And so Krill is starting to he's starting to dip pretty low, but Shifty looks like he he definitely has it there. The clone is going to come out from from Shifty's there onto Unafraid. The Silence is going to come out into Drifting. The full fear onto Easy Game. Everybody's just CC'd here, man. It looks like Ariana Grande is going to have enough breath to to bring themselves back up and try to uh, um, uh, re you know re put themselves into a good position. Yeah, Drift King's hypothermia just fell off, and he was getting a little scary there, and he didn't have Cold Snap or anything available to him. Unafraid, uh, just doing as much damage as he can to Krill. Shifty eating a little bit of CC, but I don't think that this uh, Nesper, here to beat Nesper team is going to win by pushing in like this. Unafraid now is taking quite a bit of damage as both of his teammates are CC'd. It's a 3v1. He's using evasion. Not going to do too, too much. He's at 56% health here. Easy game. Now finally gets out. Swiftman coming out onto Unafraid. Looks like he's going to be okay for now. Uh, Time Miller put into that cross CC. Polymorph into a full Cyclone. And Krill is also in a Kidney shot but he has got iron bark up he looks like he's gonna be okay but now the cyclone goes out into shifty and this is orb on top of krill right now is this gonna be dispersed i'm not sure it looks like uh he's getting uh, uh time is doing a really great job peeling this rogue off him making krill okay but this now this is killing spree he's at 60 percent health here with devouring and he's getting devouring plagues off trying to be offensive but he just can't shifty in a deep freeze and krill just hovering really really low there's the kidney shot and the smoke bomb on the on the krill is he gonna have to trinket this i don't think so i don't think he has it there's the nature swiftness coming out uh uh, looks like Krill's going to be okay for now, but he's just constantly taking so much damage. Uh, full Polymorph going on to Timilla, so he can't cross CC for his team as Krill's just constantly just taking the pressure. But he still hasn't dispersed yet, right? He's still okay. Yeah, he's still okay. Still has that disperse definitely. So, uh, kind of a little bit aggravating, probably for here to beat Nesper. I mean, once you use all your cooldowns, once you use that killing spree and that full kidney, and you don't force a, a dis uh, disperse or anything, it could be uh, really, really. Um, scary for them but krill is gonna be, get that that double fear off right there and krill still not gonna use this first oh, he did man. pretty low there shifty's gonna be put into a full cyclone there this could be dispersed maybe from krill uh, here but he's sitting at 36 percent shifty has a trinket but he's being a little bit greedy with it krill still getting pretty low and he is actually gonna empty that polymorph off of shifty x really good play by krill there full kidney goes out or half kidney goes out on the krill there dipping a little low but not enough uh, for for shifty to to not be able to bring it back up and shifty is gonna be able to to top him back up there easy game putting getting put into that full clone there. The stun is going to come out into Drifting and dipping really low there, but he doesn't want to risk it, so that is going to be the block that's going to come out. And he has a second block. He still doesn't have the cold snap, but um, you know he's going to wait to see if he's going to have to use that here in the future. And I think uh, if Ariana Grande gets a good setup, I think he's going to have to be forced to use it. Yeah, absolutely. Kidney shot uh, was going out. There's the full blind, and looks like Krill is going to be taking a little bit of damage, but he actually horrifies the mage. The mage now in a silence. As, uh, it's a triple CC. It's a 3v1 versus Drift Kings, and he has 45% health here. He's blinking away, trying to get out of the line of sight of this god comp. He's getting his water elemental back out, but he's in trouble. 19% health here, 5% health here, and he's just going to go down. They just set it up over and over on him, and they just they took it, and they're going to advance. Yeah, man, that's... It's uh, definitely God Comp, and, and quite particularly, uh, I, I'm really excited to see this God Comp, you know, uh, come. And I, you know, because the thing about this God Comp is these God Comps are really, really good players. I, I mean, I, I know Krill has been uh, playing for quite a long time, and he's made a name for himself.